and welcome. My name is Crew, and I'm playing some Titanfall, which I've been doing recently. I've put in like five hours, I think, so far. I'm level 19, and I just completed both campaigns. So, I'm running with the smart pistol right now, uh, because that's the weapon I find which is most fun to use. I'm not best with it, because I or it's not a weapon I'm the best with. I prefer other weapons to it. Or I don't prefer other weapons to it because this is so fun, but I, I, I need to get the hang of it a little bit more to use it more. Use it better, simply, to put it simply. So I like this game a lot, actually. It's it's quite it's it's fun. It's fun. It's it makes like FPS like this kind of FPS so interesting. It's the shooting, the shooting's very similar to COD, except the smart pistol and the Titans. But the thing is. The Titans and the sh the Titans and all the like parkour and everything just makes this game incredible. It makes it very very cool. So it's very enjoyable. It's uh, I don't know this and Insurgency is probably two games I'm gonna play a lot now because I've been playing Insurgency, which is a really interesting shooter too, but for completely different reasons. Come on now. That was silly. That was really silly. I got my Titan now, so I'm gonna stay low. Try to get into it without dying. There we go. And into the Titan. I always think it's a little bit weird when that happens. It's cool, but I, I never quite understand what happens. So... Oh no. Oh, shit. Um, I got this new titan, which is the ogre, which is uh, very heavily... Oh god, okay. Uh, watch where you're going, don't waste your titan like that. Holy crap, that's annoying. Uh, I did not know, okay, okay, that's fine, it happens. I don't know, I, it's, it's just so fun to take titans down. When you take a titan down single-handedly as a pilot, it's pretty cool. It's pretty fucking cool. I would try to do that in this game. Oh god, I'm just dying and dying and dying. Let's try this. So, some burnt cards give you amped up weapons. Which is a good way to let you try new weapons, but a powerful version of them though, so... The amped up weapons tend to be really good. Just extremely useful. I know there is someone around here, I saw him on the map. I wonder if I can track him down. There he is. Oh god, horrible aiming. Nice no, replacement titan. Very nice. There's someone around there. Let's see if I can hunt him down. The radar is so useful. I always there's there's a couple of different perks and there's one called minion detector, I think, which allows you to see all the minions on the map, on the minimap, which is by far the most useful perk of the three I have to shoot from. Or something like that because it's so good to be able to see where enemy grunts are enemy grunts and specters because they're a really good way to rack up your points to get a titan out fast so that's mainly where you get your score from to get the titan and I have experienced a few bugs in this game, including the audio bug we're shooting here now. I've had that the last games. I haven't had it as frequently as before, but now it's buzzing out a lot. So the game 
It's a bit buggy. It's playable. It's rally. I haven't, I haven't, like, experienced a bug that's game breaking, and it haven't crashed for me yet either, which is really good. So it's fairly, it's fairly well tested, which is nice. And I don't know, it's it's not, it's the performance is pretty bad still. The performance for me isn't like over six dollar time. It drops sub sixty quite often, which is annoying. I'm running about like forty five now, and uh, that's too low for me. I could I I haven't realized any way to like play around with the settings and stuff like that to get it working. But oh my god, Titan Fall is so fun. I have a real hard time playing it though, while commentary. Commentating. Look, I can't do. I I can do neither properly. So let's kill all of them before they go anywhere. So just more or less camp this spot or patrol it. Look, we'll have a lookout for. Because this phase, all uh, the enemy team that lost gets a chance to move out the way, get a chance to escape, escape the battlefield. And uh, I won't let them. That's the plan, at least. Oh, uh, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it got away. That was a bit spicy. Yeah, I don't know. This game is just so cool. I love it a lot. I have a few problems with it, but I don't know. Uh, it's it's basically just launch stuff, which will be fixed probably. So there's how the game works it takes a lot of getting used to, because you're not. I mean, Battlefield 4 had some vertical play gameplay, but this game got a lot more vertical gameplay. Which is nice, because everybody's running on roofs and jumping between buildings and stuff. And it's, it's pretty damn cool. And just that part makes it so much interesting that you need to, like, look around 360 degrees instead of just looking forward or behind you. You actually need to look up and down a lot. Which I'm not that used with. But that in combo with the Titan makes everything so cool. The thing is you're you're probably in a Titan like 60% of the game? 80 maybe even. It feels like I've only been in Titans, because it takes a few minutes to get in a Titan and then it's not unusual to stay in a Titan for the entire game after that. I've done that a, a couple, no, more than a couple of times. Quite a lot of times. So, yeah, I don't know. It's just very cool and need to... Come on. There we go. I, I don't know which burn cards it shows, but I just choose something real quick. Burn cards can be so useful. I had a burn card that gave me a titan. Oh, no, wait, the game have crashed once. No, it disconnected. Um, I disconnected from the server. I, I don't know why. I think my internet just passed out. But I got this burn card, which allowed me to spawn one of the titans from the get-go, which were incredible. So I had a titan from the start, which I liked a lot. Uh, oh god, uh, let's pick this dude. It's my go-to titan, which I've been using the most. It's a really fast titan, which will let you dash around a lot. And currently I'm using my shotgun, my shotgun setup. Oh god, there's enemies there. That was terrible. You shouldn't engage three or four pilots by yourself. 
I'm I've only I I don't know how many maps there are either. I have no clue. I've been only playing the um, campaign recently, and uh, this is my second or third game, which is the standard non-campaign multiplayer, and I have no clue how many maps there. Are. Oh god. Why is it so hard to play and commentate at the same time? It's, don't use a silencer on this. I, I'm i trying out a silencer right now on the shotgun. I, I, it's bad. It's increasing the range and damage quite a lot. Let's see. No, I can't get up there. Ah, Haven't quite... Oh, hello. There we go. I think it lagged a little bit there. Feels like the hit detection was slightly off. Come on, die. So the, the shotgun's really powerful, it's really fast killing. Uh, let's select a burn card. A uh, fast learner, sure. And let's go with this. I, I don't know what I think of the weapons really because like I said it feels like I've been in the Titan like most of my time Which So I know more about the Titans than I actually know about um, Like normal weapons because it feels like I barely use them I have barely use them at all That's both or good and bad because I want to use them more, I want to understand the weapons more, and which weapons are good to use when. Oh god, he jumped out of the titan, so get out of there. Let's take it down, let's take it down, there we go. Cool. So the fast learner apparently gives me double XP I think, so hopefully I will do real well from now on. Because 400 XP from one titan kill is pretty cool. Let's go stealth, there should be a titan down there, yeah. Let's avoid that if possible. There's way too many titans around. Okay, let's... Oh god! No. What a bitch, what a bitch. Um, everything's toggle. It's like toggle for this score screen and toggle for aiming and I I'm using that currently because I don't know, I can use both toggle but it's unusual for me. And the fucking audio is passing out. I'm gonna turn that down so low you barely can hear it. It's insanely annoying. Oh, hello. I love... I just love snapping people's necks. I, I think you can you can do that while stealth, too. Huh? Oh. Let's see if he gets out of his titan. He probably will. Yeah, there he goes. There we go. Sneak up behind him. Now take his titan out. Oh. Come on. There we go. Took that titan out. Auto titans are really use or easy to kill. They're really stupid. Usually they can rack up. Uh, I've been killed a few times by them if there's... If the pilot is around and running, because they can be quite a the distraction. So I haven't. That's something I want to play around more with, to actually uh, leave my Titan on autopilot and just kill people running around. That's probably something I should do more to use the weapons more and get more into that. So that's something a technique I will try to develop and see how useful it is not being in the titan like all the time because you, when you got a titan you want to be in it i mean come on it's so safe and it's the survivability is incredible in these things 
Oh, we won. Nice. Await further instructions. Epilogue. Eliminate all enemy pilots. Yes, I will try to do that. Come on, move, move out. I haven't gotten my... My... Not warp core, but it's named something similar, which allows me to... Oh! Hello. No, it, I didn't get the kill. Come on. There we go. I saw him on the map. Oh, hello. I got a guy on me. Please die. There we go. Um, I recommend like using the static, electric thing, whatever it's called. Because it's so good to kill Rodian pilots, which tends to be my downfall. But yeah, I think I will end it there. About, I don't know, 15, 16 minutes of gameplay of Titanfall. So I will probably make more content of this because I will be playing it. And I tend to make content of things I play to some extent, at least. So that's it. Have a very nice day. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a like to support me and my channel. And that's it. So goodbye.